LA City Council this morning tried once again to vote on an ordinance to ban homeless encampments within 500 feet of schools and daycare centers. But an eruption inside the chamber about 10 minutes ago caused Council President Nuri Martinez to call for a recess. It is the second week in a row the council meeting has been disrupted by protesters. CBS 2's Tina Patel has details from downtown LA. We are the people, mighty, mighty people. Homeless advocates from across LA gathered outside City Hall this morning to protest the city's approach to homelessness. The council is trying to create safe zones around schools and daycares by expanding 4118, the encampment ordinance that outlaws sitting or sleeping in certain places. These advocates say the ordinance should be abolished completely. What this legislation does is it moves people around from block to block, from district to district. And keeping these people safe. Martha Escudero is a mother, so she understands that some parents don't want their children to see encampments on their way to school. But her family used to be unhoused, and she says people on the streets need more compassion, not more rules. That really is not keeping anyone safe, especially unhoused children. They're putting them in darker corners where they're obscure, and then they are more prone to violence and death. Some homeless advocates say if there is a 500 foot radius around every school and daycare, nearly 20% of the city would become off limits. These advocates say rather than criminalizing homelessness and making more laws that would be hard to enforce, city officials need to work on creating more permanent and more affordable housing for those in need. There's a housing crisis in LA that even with dual income, people cannot even afford a, uh, to rent a home. And that's what they say everyone in the city should be pushing for. Demand permanent housing and then you won't have encampments near your schools. Feels like a simple solution to me. In downtown LA, Tina Patel, CBS2 News.